I'm excited at the prospect of doing work for the Tribunal that they cannot do for themselves anymore due to their inability to confront either Six House or a House of Troubles. Remember the House of Troubles? Those are the four Daedric Princes who did not bow down to the power of the Tribunal. Shirgorath, Molag Bal, Malakath, and Dagoth Ur. Yes, these have given the Tribunal and the Dumber people the most grief since the Tribunal took over. At least they are just trouble, being a nuisance at worst. Whereas the Sixth House was Dagoth Ur using the heart of Lorcan, and his Akulakan threatened the very existence of all people in Lundus. But the Daedric Princes have had their time to shine in plots like Dagoth Ur's too. Let us not forget the plain meld attempt by Moleg Ball in the Second Era. Apparently he came close to winning. As for any future attempts by others of the House of Troubles in Tamriel, well, I cannot say. I can just hope nothing more happens. It seems like every era gets something terrible from the Daedra, and if that is the case, then this era, the third era, even with Dagoth Ur defeated for good, means it's not over yet. However, with people like me here to stop them, they can only get so far. My strength will no doubt inspire others to rise up as well. Hearing tales of a hero's victory over the enemy can move the people to resist, since they know that that enemy can be defeated. This I hope to inspire with my efforts in Morrowind. May you find me worthy of your attention. Taller Saroni, the patriarch of the entire tribunal, temple. Faith conquers all, Narvarine. Bless your breath and blood. Yes, it's just strange to be called the Narvarine. We have heard the proclamation. Vivek has removed his curse upon the Narvarine and has ended the persecution of the dissident priests. Vivek has acknowledged you as the incarnate and Narvarine, the prophesied savior of Morrowind, and the last hope to withstand the menace of Dagoth Ur and the Sixth House. Alright, is it possible to get an advancement? The temple recognizes you, Snail Rilvane. You are now Snail Rilvane, the Diviner. Is it possible to get any duties? I am old and will soon retire. You are one of the most promising Diviners. If you want to replace me as Archcanon of the temple, you must complete the pilgrimages of the Four Corners. Tell me about them. A book called The Pilgrim's Path describes many of the temple's pilgrimages and their shrines. Yes, I've been through that. So, pilgrimages of the Four Corners. Tell me about the Four Corners. The first corner of the House of Troubles is Malakath, the Daedric patron of the orcs who tests the Dunmer for weakness. There is a shrine to Malakath on Shir Gorad, southwest of Dagonfell. Head south past the Dwemer ruins and take the second road to the west. Look for the shrine to the north. Take four Daedra hearts to the shrine. Oh. When you donate the hearts to the shrine, recite Vivek's four corners of the House of Troubles. Oh, the problem with that is I've always been selling my Daedra hearts. Okay. I wouldn't happen to have any on me, would I? I have one. One Daedra card. Hmm. I've got a few things to sell, actually. Got this glass staff, yeah. I've got a few things to sell, so we will go to Mournhold, and then we'll try to get these Dater Hearts and go up to Shia Gorad. Seems like the place that I go to Mournhold, to the trade shop, has a lot of Dater Hearts. I don't have to go anywhere to search for them. I can go straight up to Shia Gorad. Okay, that makes it all easier. How We're in Rotherin, in the Shia Gorad region. Gotta watch those things. Shani? You're wrong about me. I'm not wonderful. I can put on my smile and flirt, act nice to people, have sex with them, whatever. That's not really me, though. It just makes things easier until I get bored of doing it and stop. Oh. So, you were just pretending to like me? What do you think, Enwa? Like I said, I'm not wonderful. I'm selfish and lazy, and I don't care about anyone but myself. I lie and cheat to get what I want. I'm stupid and shallow, and I'd bet a guar if it winked at me twice. And I've done nothing but tell you off and boss you around for ages. What's wonderful about that? Hmm. Well, you do do a little bit of that, but for the most part, that's not how I see you. 
Why are you trying to push me away so hard? <sighs> you don't give up, do you? Why are you so obsessed with me? Do you think I need you, but I can't admit it? Or worse, that I don't need you, but I should, and you're going to make me? Do you think I'm broken, and only you can fix me? Because of all those things are guarship, and you better get it through your skull. I'm just fine, and I plan to stay that way. You don't really put me in a very good situ position here, Shani. What about Julan? What about him? You and Julan are close, right? Yeah, even though we're not together anymore. He knows me in my head because we grew up together, and I told him everything I was thinking all the time. You're still in love with him, aren't you? Yes, and it's horrible, and I try every day to stop. When we fell in love, I let him inside my head even more, into the parts I'd never shared with anyone. That's how he was able to tear me apart. Later, he knew exactly how to hurt me. So now you're not letting anyone get close to you ever again? Let me ask you something. Would you invite somebody to stand with a knife to your throat for the rest of your life? That's what being in love is. Why would I ever do such a stupid thing again? Uh, love isn't always like that. It was for me, and now you stand here, with your different knife, asking me to trust you. Why should I? I don't know. No, you don't, and there is nothing you can do or say to make me change my mind. Alright, well, I don't, I don't believe that, actually. Oh, you think I'm wrong. You think you're so clever. Come on, then. I'm not trying to make you do anything. You can do whatever you like, because for me, you're the one holding the knife. What do you mean? You gonna make me say it? I love you. There's a long silence, during which she stares at me grimly, as if trying to make me blink first. What do you want from me? Nothing. Then why are you telling me? I just thought you should know. You're lying. Love is all about wanting things from someone else. That's what keeps the knife so sharp. <laughs> well, if we're going to play that game, you're right. Then let me hone the weapon of my destruction. I want so many, many things. What do you want, then? <laughs> she saw through that. I want to be as close to you in every possible way. I want to make you happy. I want you to see yourself as I see you. Precious and unique and talented and beautiful in so many ways, not just physically. Are you finished? No. There's so much more, but most of all, I want you to feel the same way. I want your love, but you're free to deny it to me. You can break my heart whenever you choose. You hold the knife. And what now? Well, I won't mention it again unless you bring it up. Maybe you hate me now, but you should know how much you are loved. I see. Thank you. Um, let's just get this over with. Are women worth it? Things like this make me question that. Okay, well, I know where the shrine is. <clears throat> the general area where it is. I have a long life to live, and if she's going to continue acting like this, then there's no point in chasing after someone that is that messed up. Julan really hurt her. But, in a way it's good if I can get her to see around that. It's not here, it's, it's like to the northwest of here. If I can get her to see past that and see me for what I am. I'm sure she does. She's just... She's a bit of an idiot. Sorry to say. Then again, I don't think Julan is that brilliant of a person either. Maybe the two idiots deserve each other. What was that? Let's just 
just over this hill. I should be able to get up here and see it. Zoo left, so it's either this way or this way. Ah! Ah! Oh yeah, magical arrows, you cannot get them back once they expend their energy. Okay. A dead Ogrim. Huh. Okay, so this is obviously in Dagonfell, so we cannot go that way. It's just like right around the corner. I passed it so many times. It could be even over this hill. It's within the area. And you know, I'm really wasting my magical arrows on these things. It's down here. And there's orcs here, and I'm sliding right towards them. Oh. Yep. Ah. Ah. You two should be able to handle one orc. Ah. Oh. Ah. Gone are the days when I was excited to loot them for their armor. I mean, there is a lot of... I can probably get many thousands from these. But... No. Alright, I have the four danger cards. I don't know what's going to happen when I... What, what did he ask me to do? <sighs> I'm going to read what I wrote. Shiny. Okay. What? I must find the shrine, donate four danger hearts, and recite Vivek's Four Corners. Once, like a great house founded on sand, stood our temple whose pillars on troubles were based. Now mischievous spirits bound in dim corners stand, rotted columns but with iron-bound bands embraced, cracked crumbling marble tempered on every hand by strong steel forged in fire and faith, shackled, these wayward servants serve the land, the temple secured by the builder's grace. I hope that's enough. Okay, well, we can get back really quickly. And I can get anywhere around on the island I want to be. Welcome, friend. The day is yours. What should we talk about? Vivek, please. Hail, friend. Rain again. Okay. <laughs> Remove your armor, please. In the rain. Yeah. That's how one catches sickness. Alright, so to the patriarch we go. Logan. Have you completed the pilgrimage of the Four Corners? I did one. Is there more? I did one. Um. Okay, the second corner of the House of Troubles is Maroon's Dagon. The Daedra of Destruction, who represents the trials the Dumber face in the lands of Morrowind. At Eld Sotha, the Daedric ruins northeast of Vivic City. Oh, that's really close. I've been there before. Vivic rescued Sotha Sil, the only survivor of the minor house Sotha, from the armies of Maroon's Dagon. Fight your way to the statue of Maroon's Dagon and recite Vivic's four corners of the House of Troubles. There's a statue there? 
in El Sarta? I see this land suits you. Um, we welcome you freely. Let's find Captain all the, find the statue of Maroon's Dagon in El Sarta. Okay. Uh, yeah, okay. We gotta go. Three blessings, friend. The day is getting on. I need weak levity. I could use water walking, actually. Old South is really close. Right here. Water walking. We're not going to make it to the land. Well, really close. There it goes. Ah. Oh. Ah. Those tusks of those kagutis always dead my armor. Dent my armor, I should say. Sometimes they bend it inward. Okay, so El Safa is directly this way. Magnus has gone down, or almost down. I'm getting late, and I want to get this over with. So, cross this bridge. I don't know what to do about Shani, but I guess I've left it in her. With her to, to say, say something. I think that she does have feelings for me. I think that she's hurt by Julan. And she's trying to push me away. Because she's afraid of being hurt again. The more she feels for me, the more hurt she's worried she'll become. So I don't think that she loves me. And she's trying to push me away. Well, that actually would be the best case. <laughs> hey. Could it get any worse? Are you able to say anything about Shani? Yeah, I warned you. All right, that doesn't help. Shani, put on your armor. Rain again. Okay. Ooh, cold. Cold water. But it's supposed to be inside El Salta. I've been in there. I don't remember a statue to... wait, a who? Maroon's Dagon, the Prince of Revolution or something. Hello. I don't think we've been introduced that letter. I'm Nathala, horrendous. Um, how can I help you? What do you do? Bringing the glory to the of the three, blessed by the names, to heathens and data worshippers. That is my calling. I see. Well, you're good, doing good work. Except there is Daedra around here. That's right, Julian. I don't want to... Good job. I cannot take the cold. It's horrible. Torture. Alright, we've got to find a way down. Obviously, the Daedra have come back. 
since we've been here. And no, I don't remember every Daedric Shrine, but... Okay, so this way somewhere is this way, straight ahead. Here. At least we're out of the rain. Okay. Yo, Enma. What do you see? Oh, it must have conjured it. Uh, okay. Daedric Staff, Ebony Staff, The Wolf Queen, Book 4, Chances Folly, I like that book, Ancient Dagoth Brandy, you know what, I would, I've been here, I assume, yeah, I remember the Dagoth Brandy, I'm not drinking that, <laughs> probably know there's essence of corpus meat in there, even if I'm immune, I still wouldn't drink it, I am immune, I'm immune to corpus disease, I'm still not going to drink that. Ah. Boy. I've, uh, learned to really hit hard. Okay. A little poison there. Oops. That's Mirren's Dagon. He has four arms, right? Okay, let's make sure there's nothing in here. Oh, the saint! Ooh. Strange noise. Another Dramora. Yeah, I have been through here. Yep, I took the gem from here too. Okay. Not like I'm worshipping. I am helping the tribunal. Once like a great house founded on sand, stood our temple whose pillars on troubles were based. Now mischievous spirits bound in dim corners stand. Rotted columns, but with iron bound bands embraced. Cracked, crumbling marble, tempered on every hand, by strong steel forged in fire and faith. Shackled, these wayward servants serve the land, the temple secured by the builder's grace. Okay, Om CV, intervention. Hello. Okay, yeah, I don't need to hear about your views on the tribunal. Yeah. Rain again. Yeah, remove your armor. Um, just because it makes me feel uncomfortable. Oof, that rain. May you find me worthy of your attention. I have completed another one. What's the next one? The third corner of the House of Troubles is Mulag Ball. Who tries to destroy the Dummer by corrupting our bloodlines? Bal Ur is known as the birthplace of Molag Ball, where the Doom Drum tricked Molag Ball into becoming mortal. Vivek defeated Molag Ball here and sent him back into oblivion. Bal Ur is just north of Saran, but to get there easily, you will need a way to levitate over the mountains. I know exactly where that is. It's actually on my map with the name Bal Ur. Um, you need to wait to levitate. Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty good that way. But what do I do once I get there? Wait. 
Is it that I'm giving a Daedra heart up for each one? That's why I needed four for each of the corners. Okay, so... What's the quickest way to get there? Could I go to Telesiro? I think Telesiro... There's Mirandas. But I can go straight shot from Telesiro. Which is here. Well, no, Telesiro's right here. And it's north... Oh, this is Telesiro right here. Okay. I can go directly there, and it's right up here. Ball er. However, Mirandas... I don't know which one is closer. I think if I go to Telesiro, a lot of the will be levitation to get over, because it's all mountains. But if I go from Mirandas, a lot of it's running, and I've actually been that way. Uh, Lake uh, Nabia. It was, it's been months. Twelve more days until my birthday. Hmm. Okay, so let's go recall. Welcome, friend. The day is yours. What shall we talk about? Caldron, please. Cal Caldron. <laughs> Caldera, please. Welcome, Dunmer. You honor me. Do you wish to do shall business? We? Yes, send me to Mirandas. Ah. ah, the thunder sound always hurts my ears. Yeah, I kind of forgot about sleeping. <laughs> Go ahead. <laughs> I'm just, I'm excited to get this done with, actually. And my head is also in a different place because of this woman. Replace your armor. Such a pretty face. Hello, Dunmer. Hello, Sino Rilvain. I've heard that Lord Vivek has declared you to be the incarnate and narrow Varina prophecy. Sudden changes of doctrine upset some people, but Dagoth Ur is the real enemy, and we offer prayers and thanks for the new hope you bring us. Now, how can I help you? Are you looking for someone in particular? Do you need services? What services out here? What's your, what do you, what's your name and what do you do here? I am Tevin Athan, barbarian and lawman of the Great House Redrun. Uh, we have something in common then. Okay. Great House Redrun. Yeah, uh, Magnus is, has gone down a long time ago. But at the least, it is not as hot. Anywhere near as hot as it was last time I came around this way. So this is Lake Nabia. And if you just follow it, follow the river. I think I hear an ash storm kicking up. If you follow it, it takes you right to Bell Earth. Yeah, it was an ash storm. At least it's pushing me the way I want to go. And it's not getting in my face. But I can't really see much. My danger sense is up. Maybe not. Whoa! It's a blighted outlet. <sighs> okay. It's just gotta be over this hill, I should see it. Yeah, here it is. I remember coming by this way. I killed some cultists on the top, but... I see something down there. It's an outlet. I didn't go inside of it. Ah, missed. What? She landed. What? Nine. Uh, well, I'm, I'm like, we're gonna find the entrance. It's very hot in here, actually. Entrance has to be around here somewhere. Oh, 
Here it is. Ball-er. We made it. 